Hello Internet, it is I, Malik Aaron Aaron, and welcome back to another gameplay video. Today we are playing the Jack and Daxter collection for PS3. So this is a compilation of HD remasters of the original three Jack and Daxter games. You got Jack and Daxter the Precursor Legacy, Jack 2, and Jack 3, all originally developed by Naughty Dog for the PS2. Yeah, Naughty Dog used to make games like this. Kind of hard to believe since they've been stuck on Uncharted and especially Last of Us for so long. And I've never played a Jack and Daxter game in my life, so I have no idea how this is going to go. It's not like how I played Tools of Destruction or God of War Ascension, where although I never played those games before, I played games in those specific series before, so I knew what to expect. I knew how they would play. Here, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. I heard Jack 2 is rather brutally difficult. I don't know if I'm going to get to the brutally difficult part <laughs> when I do play it. I doubt it's in the very beginning of the game. But yeah, I've never played these before. I always wanted to. I always thought about it, but I never had the urge to get them. But then I got my PS3 and I found this for like $28, which end up being a steal because trying to find like the original three Jack and Daxters like separately on PS3 they're like $15 each that would have cost me like $45 so I saved a nice amount of money getting this so I made a smart financial decision so yeah these should be good games though hopefully they don't piss me off too bad so yeah let's let's do this Alright, we are back on the PS3, and in a few seconds, there it is, playing Jack and Daxter. So yeah, I have no clue how this is going to go. I have zero experience with any of these games, so it's going to be my first time with all of them. Uh, it should be good. Alright, so, here's the menu where you can pick between the games. So first you have Jack and Daxter, or Jack and Daxter the Precursor Legacy. Then you have Jack 2. Then you got Jack 3. So you just pick between any of them. We're gonna go in order. So first, Jack 1. Just gonna wait. Obviously, new game. Yes. Uh. All right. I have spent my life searching for the answers that my father and my father's fathers failed to find. Who were the precursors? Why did they create the vast monoliths that litter our planet? How did they harness eco, the life energy of the world? What was their purpose? And why did they vanish? I have asked the plants, but they do not remember. The plants have asked the rocks, but the rocks do not recall. Even the rocks do not recall. on the shoulders of a young boy, oblivious to his destiny, uninterested in the search for truth, and rejecting of my guidance. And why would he want to listen to old sailors the sage anyway? Why will it a master of great ego, one of the wisest men on the planet? <sighs> so it seems the answer 
cancer begins not with careful research or sensible thinking. Nay, as with many of fate's mysteries, it begins with but a small act of disobedience. Hey, not Jack. Old Greenstuff told us not to come here. Alright, we're about to start playing soon. And these graphics, I mean, like, I don't know. I, I can't imagine the PS2 version looks a whole lot better than this. Or a whole lot worse. Bob's this is like HD high. I guess for like what's supposed to be a 2001 game, looks alright. Deal harshly with anybody who strays from the village. We will attack. Yep, I, I can definitely see a character that's been. Give them. Definitely got the rule 34 treatment. No doubt about that. What are we doing here anyway, Jack? This place gives me the creeps. Oh, yeah. Jack, in the first game, he's a mute. He doesn't talk. He doesn't start talking until like 2 and 3. What is that dark ooze? It should have been friendly. <sighs> the sage yaks on about the precursor that built this place all the time. Where did they go? Why did they build this crap? Now, I like precursor horns and power cells as much as the next guy. But if you ask me, they must have been a real loser. Wow! How did you do that? Uh oh. I think we're in trouble! <laughs> Oh damn. That's no good. Oh, that's really not good. Man, that stung. I told you we shouldn't have come here, and you listened. What? Yeah, it's very much not fun. So yeah, Daxter was like a human before it became this what thing. Which is not like a, an ox wait, 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 soul. It's like a mix between a weasel and, and, and an otter. The two of you went mucking around in the only place that I told you not to go. Miss the island. That's right. And then and Daxter, you finally took a much needed bath. But in a bathtub filled with dark eco. I'm gonna keep yapping because in my professional opinion, the change is an improvement. And besides, I couldn't help you if I wanted to. What? There's only one person who has studied Dark Eco long enough to have a chance at returning you to your previous form. Carl Acheron, the sage. But he lives far to the north. Far, far to the north. Nobody has spoken to him in ages. I would teleport you there, but I can't do that either. None of the three sages that maintain the other teleporter gates have seen fit to turn their ends on for quite a while. The only other way north is by foot through the fire canyon, but its volcanic soil is hot enough to melt precursor metal. You can't just walk through it. But you could fly over it if you had a door equipped with a heat shield. I just happen to be working on such a thing at this very moment. All I would need is 20 power cells to give it enough energy to withstand the canyon's heat. Hey, we're 
are actually doing stuff. Okay, so X is the jump. Circles to pun. Circles to kick. And triangle is, I guess, the zoom in. I don't got these eggs. Is that it? Is it for now? Okay, well I can't deal with that. I think that's it for all, you know, in this area. So we'll smash these things up. Smash this. Twenty of those. All right. Well, that was close. Furbies, <laughs> which is saying a lot because Furbies already look demented. Forgetting, like, I can't smash those. There we go. Oh, what now? Okay. So, I gotta find some blue eco then. Wow, that's convenient. Okay, well, let's go. You know, gotta go fast, because that's, that's what this reminds me of. Oh, I got our second one. We got a trophy, too. It's really hard to believe that, like this game, like Naughty Dog, we're making game, we're make, we're making like a game like this, something like, like a platformer type of game. And it's really, you know, it's gonna be real jarring to play like Jack Two when it takes like a drastic turn in tone. Because this is like fairly like lighthearted. Big 
I, I already figured that out, Vini. You don't need the tone in. Is that it? I think that it. Yeah, that, that's it. Okay. No more of these. You can jump once and jump again in the air to reach even higher legends. Think of that one. Oh, jump forward. Okay. Another one. I think after that, I think I'm going to switch over to Jack 2. Yeah, over here. This is what I miss. Oh, that was it? That's all it took? Daxter with that smile, he looks so <laughs> tormented. Jeez, I don't like that. No, I don't think so. I think we only need like four. Let's go back. Oh, I didn't even know that was called. Okay, I found this by complete accident. I got 50, and it's all 50 that I need. Nothing else to go over here. So let's go back. Oh god, I'm getting lost. <laughs> So we can shoot. Well, they're all the same, so what's the point of this? They're all the same thing. I'm trying to figure it out. Oh, just the leaf through here. There's like an opening. Oh, right here. I didn't realize. Yeah, it's 
it's weird. This game it feels like so calm, and then it takes like a turn towards edge. <laughs> in the sequels. I can't even go to sleep. What's wrong with that? Okay. I'm I'm four percent done with the game already. Oh, all right. Guess I'll just save. One heart to save again. You never know. Quit. Yes. Assume I have to like quit the whole thing. Cause I'm not sure. Oh gosh, I'm not doing this right. Let me escape. There has to be a way to get out of here. No. Hmm. I guess I have to completely like quit the game. Okay, that's fine. Now it's time to like pause the game, pause the video so I can get back to like the main screen. Okay, we're back to the main screen. So we did Jack and Daxter, now on to Jack 2. With his dramatic tonal shit. And apparently this game is, has a reputation for being ridiculously hard. I don't think we're really going to get to the hard part in this video. I doubt it. But hopefully it won't be too frustrating. So now, now we wait again. Okay. I know by playing this whole collection, I'm basically just I'm ruining the plot for you and me. Okay, this is just like the beginning of like the, the first game again. Models definitely improved from the game to game. That's very much not not good at all.
I swear, that's the last time I ever, ever touch any stupid precursor crap. Two years later. So what, have, I, have I been in prison this whole time? Oh god damn, I'm getting tortured. This game definitely took a, a definitely a change. From like the language to like what's being shown, yeah, this game is definitely a T-rated game. I think the change is like way more drastic than like a Ratchet and Clank, because at least Ratchet and Clank that started as like a T-rated game. It was it wasn't like a like Jack that that was an E-rated game. It was E, but Jack 2 is T rated. Like, that's, that's a big leap for a series. Oh my god. <laughs> how, did, how did I mess up that bad? So, what do I do? Apparently in this game you do use guns. I mean the cover of the game shows Jack with a gun. So. I don't know what to do. It's not really giving me like instructions. There's steps here, so maybe that could lead to something. You remember how to jump? Okay. Because I, I was right. Please tell me you remember how to roll. Yes, I can roll. Jeez, like that's with like Mr. Fantastic and he's just stretching all over the place. Oh, look at another more precursor things. Precursor eggs. If only I can get to it. But it's all the way up there. Except to make like a special jump. Yep, I was right. We might find a few hidden around, or get some to a difficult task. We'll be able to buy stuff with them. Oh, okay, so this is currency. Use those as currency to like get upgrades and stuff. Okay. It's a high ledge. Try jumping once, then jump again while in the air to reach that one. There are lots of crimson guard crates lying around for the taking. Break that crate. Okay, there's like. I guess I can jump over these. I thought that might take too long. You know what? I'm gonna try. No, okay, that, that was a huge mistake. 
thought I could jump on him, but I very much can't. You know what I find uh, kind of interesting that just like Ratchet and Clank, something that's like very easily noticeable is that. But I don't, I don't know why it is. But in the first games of both series, like Ratchet and Jack, they don't wear shoes, but in like the sequels, they wear shoes. Oh, uh, just something I thought was interesting. And where the both games where they start with their original character designs and then they change like later. Again, it's a little weird coincidence. And both this and uh, Ratchet and Clank uh, 2 are going commando. Have a reputation for being difficult, but with Jack 2 apparently it's a lot worse when it comes to difficulty. This is very different from like Jack One Star. Jack One, I didn't have any enemies. You can get a longer jump by rolling into it. Okay, but I didn't do that. But yeah, I got a precursor in, so it's nice, I guess. Guess I can go all the way back up. At least in theory. L wants to roll, right? Okay. Alright, nice. Nailed that. Uh oh. Oh. Oh gosh. The same basic combat. There is no escape. Do these lead anywhere? So, looks like it. So I might as well go over here first. Okay. Let's look over here. Okay, there's another precursor egg. Let's jump to it. Oh, damn it. I need momentum. Oh, come on. <laughs> How was that not enough momentum? Oh, god damn it. Shouldn't be that hard. Oh, oh god, it's like. I've never played Cuphead, but I know the infamous, like, tutorial where you try to like, jump, reach a ledge, it's just not happening. I'm getting that vibe here. That Cuphead. Vibe. God damn it, like I can't I'm trying to jump properly, this is not Come on. Why am I struggling so bad with this one jump? Just with like this one egg. Damn it. Grab Why couldn't he grab it? He could have easily just stretched his arms out and grabbed the damn thing. Look. Look at that. Like, what is that? 
It's like the moment I hit it, I slide. How am I supposed to roll? I have like no room to roll. Ooh, I'm starting to feel a bit of that difficulty <laughs> already. This is just for getting a stupid egg. I'm trying like so hard. I can do this. I know I, 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 I gotta believe in myself. Nope. Ugh. Like, why is this so difficult? Just grab onto something, Jack. Like, Christ. That's all you have to do. Oh my god. Forget it. It's not worth it. Wait, actually, how come it didn't work like there? Like I, I, I held down R one, like L L one. Okay, that didn't work. Let me see the order. Okay, I have to hold down L one. It didn't work anyway. Fuck, fuck the egg. I'm done. I'm done with that. Okay, I got a mini map. Alright, there's a bunch of civilians just walking around being as light, real lifeless. I, I, Jeez, this game is so grim <laughs> in comparison to the original. And it just started. Hello, strangers. My name is Cor. May I help you? Sonic uh, the Warehog from Sonic the Moon. I can't really like drive, I can just like grab on. Poor kid, what type of trophy is that? Oh, I could just steal it. Okay, we're just going to Grand Theft Auto. This is kind of neat. Oh gosh, oh no. <laughs> 
Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna be the hero they need. But that was fun. I do wonder when I'm gonna be able to use a gun. They're everywhere. I gotta get out of here. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Don't. Damn. Oh no. I am gonna die. I get out of here. Oh no. Oh, oh god. Okay, I think I think I'm done. God, what is this? The whole the whole ass ring, the whole ass circle to do this. What are the secrets? What secrets? There's a small head mode, there's a big head mode. Oh my gosh, look at all that. Hero mode, what the hell is that? Is that like ultra hard mode? Because that's the vibe I'm getting. Guess I will save. I will save and I will leave if I can. Restart sort of shit. Okay. I am quitting, yes. Alright. So that was Jack 2. And now I pause again and we get to Jack 3. So, yeah, I gotta go back, all the way back again, and okay, another pause. All right, we're back to the main, main menu. So, Jack and Daxter, 4%, Jack 2, 2%, now we're on the Jack 3. Hopefully, this should be easier than Jack 2. I know I only played like a, a sliver of Jack 2, but damn. That is not the first game, not at all. It doesn't, I mean, it plays similar enough, but there's a lot. It's, it, it's very different in just how everything feels, how everything looks. And that first game, you definitely can't like hijack um, moving, you know, you know, flying vehicles. So I don't know what Jack 3 is gonna offer. Dax 
So we don't even start with like a start screen. Almost like Jax did some flashbacks. Before seeing you crimson death bots are holding the vital section of the industrial area. My men are getting their asses kicked. That's why I'm in the situation in the desert. Uh oh. What is up with that bird? It's like a mix of a bird and a monkey. Oh no, we're getting Marat. We're getting a whole bunch of flashbacks. Imagine the mirages are going to start hitting. Some man of steel level destruction. Okay, someone found this. Okay, we actually now have the start screen. We have a new game. Yes. that don't grow up. Then it will be as if we never found 
around you. Mm -hmm. I was afraid of that. Oh boy. Oh, great. Some people appreciate my talents. It's working for a living. I saw a few of the fights earlier. Oh, not a pretty sight. Why, you little let the games begin! Alright. I guess I can do this, and you know, once I'm done, then I'll be the end of the video. Gotta climb up the ladder. So I gotta get the rest of these little floating orbs. I wasn't able to do that with like that box and like Jack 2 because well I had like no room to do it. I remember that the roll and then jump. There we go. All right, got all those orbs. So where is this taking me? I we triggered a cutscene. Gone now. Prepare the arena for full combat. Prepare the arena for full combat. I just said that. I know I was just, uh, you know, how you do the thing with the. Anyway, prepare the warriors. You mean we, we have to fight against actual people? With actual weapons? Who actually will hurt us? I feel like seventeen more of these guys. Fifteen. Oh, what the? That was that. Just opened up. Oh, I got, I got a horrific death. I need ammo. Well, I guess I don't need to shoot the different things to melee attacks. Oh, sh shit. What the? F I have, like, no time to prepare. Oh, I don't even, like, replenish my ammo. I can't even get that. 
Oh, I guess I can. Cool. Hold the bell down. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Oh, it just collapsed on Dax. Close. Well, that guy's still up there. At least he was smart. Oh, oh, what? I thought that. I thought I got. Fuck me. Okay, so after this sec, I'm definitely done with the video. Cause I don't think I can do this. I can keep on doing this. Yeah. Oh, oh, stand here. Oh, that guy, that guy just killed himself. You can't even blame me for that one. Again, are you serious? All right, we're gonna, okay, we're gonna do this one more time. Oh, yeah, I keep falling to the, the, the damn lava. Oh god, no, no. Fuck, save. God damn. Oh 
gosh, the camera, what was going on there? Oh, oh god. Alright. I am determined to beat this. Deaths are so quick. I haven't really at least expected. I keep moving when I'm not supposed to. But I do it one move and I move too much and then I fall in. Dark Jack over here. Yeah, this is working out way better. gonna do it. Just one, and it's over. Thank God. Ugh. I didn't mean that well, if I'm just stuck as me. Your victory, a gun mod is your prize. Oh yeah, now we're talking! 
with a blaster mod. So I can switch buttons. Wait for this to load. Okay, I think we're done. That's why I really don't want to do anything else after that. Like, no. So I'm 3% done already. Yeah, I'm, I'm done. All right, so that was the Jack and Daxter collection. Overall, these games play fairly well. Jack and Daxter, the first one. It's definitely the easiest one. That things take just a drastic leap with two and three. With, uh, I mean, you saw the results of those games. Uh, but I mean, I mean, it's a bold choice to like change like the tone of like a of any like a movie show game like so drastically. So I mean, kudos for Naughty Dog for willing to take some leaps with the Jack and Daxter games. I can see myself playing through these. Very much struggling through Jack two and three. Um, I I can easily see myself beating the first game. That shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, I, I'm glad I. I have these, I'm glad I played them, and yeah, that's it. So, next gameplay video. We're playing an Insomniac game, and no, it's not Ratchet and Clank. Not yet. Not more Ratchet and Clank. But that's coming, I can tell you that. We're going to be playing a series, well, the first game in a series that no one really talks about when it comes to insomniac games and this game is important because it was a launch title for the ps3 and that game is resistance fall of man so that should be fun so stay tuned for that uh and yeah so that's it that's all uh make sure to subscribe like this video leave a comment Turn on, turn on notifications, share the whole drill. You want to check out more gameplay videos I've done on the channel. I've done all types of games, different eras, genres, console series, you name it. Okay, so Jack and Daxter. I obviously played the first three games. I know there's Jack X Combat Racing. I don't have that one. I don't think it's really necessary. Uh, I know there's the Daxter game, but that's on PSP, so I can't really play that. I know there's a Jack and Daxter New Frontier. I heard that one's kind of just not good. So, yeah, I played like the, I've not played the important Jack and Daxter games. When it comes to Naughty Dog games in general, I played all the Uncharted games, minus the Vita one. So, one, two, three, four, and Lost Legacy. I played Last of Us 1, I played Last of Us 2. And the, I haven't played the original Crash Bandicoot games, I've played the ones that are included in uh, the Insane Trilogy, which are just remakes. But yeah, I think I played like all the major uh, Naughty Dog games out there. So if you want to watch any of those other gameplay videos of Uncharted and Last of Us, you can go right ahead. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's all. Goodbye.